Hey guys, Paulie Howard. I'm with Fox Sports Radio. It's Monday, September 28th. Before I tell you what I'm betting, time to rant and run. The late game stunk yesterday, but a pretty good week in the NFL. The best news possible for the Steelers and Roethlisberger. He's only out four to six weeks. That looked a lot like the Brady injury in 2008 when he was out for the year with the ACL. That's what worried the Steelers and the Steelers fans, and rightfully so. But they'll get him back in four to six. Can Vic come in, manage the game, and be serviceable? He did it yesterday, but how long can that defense stand up and play like they did yesterday? Short turnaround as Vic has to get ready as they play Baltimore on Thursday. I, I did a triple take. Baltimore's favorite on the road? you got to be kidding me. Have the odds makers watched them play? That defense is atrocious. Feel free to put some on A.J. Green. Guy's running wide open. Baltimore's awful. Just the, the penalties, the defense, 0-3 for a reason. And we'll see how the Steelers do now with Big Ben out. The FU Tour is underway. Don't piss off the Patriots and Tom Brady. 51-10, midway through the fourth quarter, Brady is in the game and they're throwing the football. Going into a bye week, you certainly don't want a bye week when you're playing like that. Then they take on the Cowboys and the Snitches Get Stitches game coming up Sunday night against the Colts. That could get ugly. Great start for the Patriots. I've already had a couple people tell me who's going to beat this team. It's early, but just a couple people telling me who's going to beat this team in the AFC. And don't give me Denver. you got to be kidding me. That team could be 0-3. They're catching a lot of breaks. Manning still has that hot dog arm. Thrown it up. Hell of a play by Sanders and Thomas to save him yesterday. And we all know about Matt Stafford. Good tw tweet from Joe Fortenbaugh. He's Cutler without the pouty face. Uh, also, Atlanta, huge win. Julio Jones could set all kinds of records this year. Catches, touchdowns, receptions. They spread them out. They, they move them around. You can't stop that guy. He's got 12 catches every game. And the come from behind win, at least Quinn, and Atlanta was able to figure it out at halftime that all Dallas was doing was short underneath crossing routes, and they couldn't stop it. Randall started with three long runs. I think he had 11, he had 11 carries for two yards the rest of the game. Whedon, eh, horrible pick. The numbers look good, but he didn't do anything in the second half. Good win for Atlanta, 3-0. Houston at home Sunday. They could move to 4-0 there, and that's a great uh, story so far. And we have our first London game coming up uh, Sunday morning, 6.30 a.m. Pacific. That's Miami and the Jets, the Dolphins. My God, their worst loss to start the season at home in Dolphins history. Blown out, 27 to nothing at one point. Great bounce back by Rex Ryan, Taylor, and the Bills. Good job there. Final week of the Major League Baseball season. Here we go. Pretty much everything is settled. But, uh, you know, the Dodgers win tonight. They clinch. Granke's never lost to the Giants. We'll see how the Astros do on the road. They've been awful on the road. They finished with their last six games on the road. Angels all of a sudden red hot, only half a game back. They start a three-game series at home against the A's. Twins, eh, still in a game and a half back, but a, a big four-game series against Cleveland. There'll be some losses there. We'll see what Houston's made of and now that they go on the road to finish the season. Time to tell you what I'm betting. Two premium pro picks up at pregame.com. Good fella. Off a 6-1 and one football weekend and his game of the year win. He's got the Monday night football game of the week that goes today. A pick you must have. Nice effort. Good fella. Keep it going. And Steven Nova, a 10-4 and three-star run. Four in a row in Major League Baseball. He has a three-star that goes today in Major League Baseball. Two picks you must have. And this is the final day for the special bulk offer. The bulk offer discount. $500 gets you $1,000. An extra $500 in free buying power. Today's the last day. Great offer. Get that at pregame.com. Small card today. We couldn't find two pros to agree on the same game, so we're off today. We are back on Tuesday, and as always, betting half a unit on this one, the free pick, J.R. O'Donnell on the Blue Jays. Minus $1.25 on the road against Baltimore. Read his full write-up and analysis and get all the free picks up at pregame.com. I've ranted. Now I'm going to run. Good luck out there. We'll see you tomorrow on pregame.com.